The celebration of reading, and this year is our 11th annual celebration of reading, really began to sort of honor the children of our community and all those companies and individuals who came together uh, to make this program a success. Our original goal with this program was to give out a thousand books, and we are celebrating the fact that we've just distributed our 780,000th free book. This doesn't happen alone. This happens because of the collaboration of just thousands of young people, retired citizens, volunteers from virtually every company and every section of our, our community. So to celebrate that, to celebrate a collaboration for our children, uh, we decided to do a celebration of reading. We had no idea that it would be this successful, ever. When, when the Bethlehem Area School District children come, all these young people have a sense that they too can make a difference. How important that is for us as human beings to give that gift to our children so they in fact know that they do have something to offer. We want every child in this community, regardless of their age, to understand first of all how important they are to us, but also what they have to give. A community, I think, is really judged ultimately by how it does come together looking towards the future. If we in fact instill in these young people who volunteer, who do book drives, if we instill in them a sense that they are so vitally important to who we are as a community, our future is better because that continues. There is nothing that, that can compare to the feeling that you get when you know you have something to give. And these young people give consistently year after year uh, day after day. We have volunteers in our reading room for virtually every event that we have. Uh, we have volunteers from the school district in our reading every Wednesday uh, that the, the reading room is open to the community. That tells me that they in fact want to do something, that they want to be involved. And literacy is a very special thing. Literacy is the greatest equal equalizer. I'm a child of poverty and I grew up right here on the south side of Bethlehem. It is because the Bethlehem Area School District was so kind to me and to my brothers and the community was so kind to me and my brothers that I am here today and able to do this. This is my gift back and I love for our young people to know that, to know that someone will do this because that, that community, that school district was kind to them. Uh, this is not about money, this is about literacy, and our children get that. I think the whole community gets that, but in particular, our children get that. Mm -hmm.